Mav, drop the pipe! Drop the pipe! Mav, drop the pipe! Hi everyone, Donut here. I haven't done a shooting in like two weeks since the one cops almost killed their friends in that really crazy crossfire. Say that three times fast. Somehow no one was hit during that. Divine intervention. Go watch it right now. I got you a shooting today though where a lady is running around Tent City doo doo sh <laughs> land just booping people on the head with a metal pipe. She's just giving people little boops. Before we get into the metal pipe booping spree, we should probably talk about the best way to hear those boops on old lady skulls. The best way to hear that is from my sponsor, Raycon Earbuds. Do you want to listen to people get hit by cars while running from the police in crystal clear quality? He just got hit! And you want a pair of earbuds that start at half the price of other premium audio brands? That's where Raycon comes in! Raycon! Raycon's been one of my longest running and most trusted sponsors. I've kept this sponsor around because I really like their product. With eight hours of playtime and 32 hours of charge time on the battery case, you can't go wrong. They don't fall out of your ear either. I'm going to be using my Raycons when I get on an airplane here in a couple days to go to Nashville and watch Brandon Herrera beat the f*** out of Action Man. Why will I be using my Raycons on an airplane? Because babies scream and they have noise isolation that you can easily get to with the click of a little button. Look, everyone's ears is different, but they got different fits and colors and styles for everyone. Look at these f Raycons. Look at these Raycons. Look how happy this motherfucker is with his Raycons. So if you want to help support my channel and get a badass pair of earbuds, then head on over to buyraycon.com slash operator and get 15% off right now. Raycon, now let's get on with the shootings, but first I just want to say LAPD does an excellent job with their breakdowns. Hosted by the wonderful yet little bit monotone Kelly Munez. I'm pronouncing your name wrong. Not on purpose. I'm dumb. I just wanted to talk about their breakdown a little little bit because they they get silly and i know it's for legal reasons but it's just it's silly. I enjoy the little things in life. Like one of the largest police agencies in our entire country having to be PC when they're showing a video about a lady getting shot. In addition, there may be strong language used by those shown in the video. She's like, sorry, sorry, there may be some curses in here during this video of a lady being legally murdered. And I mean, I understand it a little bit with everyone being sensitive little <laughs> especially in California. LAPD doesn't want to get sued by someone's extended family who hasn't talked to them in years just because an officer said <laughs> during an arrest. He was a good boy. Let's get on with the metal pipe boots and a shooting. July 9th, 2023, 9 a.m. West Los <laughs> Shackle Angeles. People started calling in a 911 and saying, hey, there's a crazy <laughs> walking around doing boops on random people with a metal pipe for no damn reason. But that's a good reason for police to be dispatched. I'm on Reseda and Hatteras and there's this woman in gray uh, sweat suit type thing on onesie holding a jacket with a metal pipe and I just saw her assault this woman that's walking her dog. And that's not the only call that LAPD received. A Hispanic man calls in and says, hey, a lady got booped on the head by some other person. She's laying on the ground bleeding. Mande, hay una señora golpeada, ¿dónde? Golpeada de la cara, se, se cayó y, y está sangrando mucho. Sí. So at this point, dispatch is still confused whether or not a lady got hit by a car or there was some booping. But then the housekeeper from Family Guy called in and cleared everything up. I'm with the resident right now, bleeding, and according to her, she was taking a walk and I did somebody hit her and hit. she fell. Okay, so an auto, a car hit her, ran her over. No, no, she's in, uh, she, we're in the state right now. No, no, there's no car involved. I think she got assaulted, correct? Huh? So it wasn't the car that hit her then? No, 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 no car involved, sir. The plot thickens. Then another guy calls. Uh, breathing and something else. I'm looking, I'm about 50 feet from it right now. I'm watching other people. All right, are you able to get near her to see if uh, she's alert and answering questions appropriately? There's about three or four people around her right now. She seems to be conscious and talking. LAPD actually put out about 10 minutes of phone calls where people were calling 911 saying, hey, someone running around with a pipe booping people. This is not good. They need to get their 40 Mike Mike Ouchie rounds, tasers, and guns, then head out there immediately, foreshadowing. How do I know they need to stop her quickly? Because I know that a metal pipe can be a deadly weapon. I actually tested this theory last year when Ballistic Dummy Labs was nice enough to send me a couple of their corpses. Check this out. I mean, what's right is right. They don't give a ah, f about it. Ah, oh, ah, 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 Frankie. Now that we know a metal pipe will absolutely f 
your sh up. Let's watch some of the security camera footage of this lady going around doing the boops. You're gonna be fucking tired of the word boop after this video, I swear. He was even called on cell phone footage by someone standing aside watching the boobs. So LAPD rolls out and finds four victims total. They run into one guy that saw the boops. Uh, my neighbor got hit in the head with a pipe by some man. Uh, my wife took her to the hospital. She's, I think she's there right now, but I, I did a quick sweep. I didn't see anyone with a, uh, driving around. I didn't see anyone with a pipe. Just, just want to point that out in case, you know. You did she? So your wife took this other person to the, the hospital? hospital? Yeah. Then they find an elderly victim in the back of an ambu. Yeah, okay. just came right up the just like out of nowhere. Totally unprovoked yeah. and yeah. just... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Five minutes after they located the elderly victim in the back of that ambu, they found our suspect at a gas station with the booper still in her hand. Hey! Drop the pipe! Drop the pipe! Man, drop the pipe! Drop the pipe! That's right, she took a 40 Mike Mike Ounty round, one of those foam bastards, to her chest like it was nothing and kept advancing on the officer. Ma'am, drop the pipe! Drop the pipe! Ma'am, drop the pipe! Wait a minute, where's this secret booper hideout that LAPD was blurring in their press release of the shooting? Enhance. 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 It couldn't be the 76 gas station at the Burbank and Rosita. How did I ever figure that out? With my super high-tech crime software, of course. I'm just kidding. The f***ing cop said it like three seconds later. We're going to be on Burbank and Rosita at the... LAPD is f***ing silly sometimes with their media releases. Anyways, the lady got shot three times while taking a 10-second taser ride. Let's watch the officer's body camera footage with the 40 mic mic. Dude, she really brushed that 40 mic mic off. I want to smoke some of what she's smoking. We got another angle too. Let's watch real quick. The officer with the taser. This one's important because you can see how close she came to booping the officer who had the lethal cover. Lethal cover, of course, you need when you have officers with non-lethal cover in case things go wrong, which it almost did. They just happened to tase and shoot at the same time. It happens. Officers immediately started CPR, but unfortunately she had way too many holes in her chest and she passed away in the hospital. If you want to see the raw footage of this without all the blurs and the weird noises and the sh** that I have to do to keep a roof over my head, then you can go watch that over at Donuts Raw Police footage. In the meantime, if you want to help support the channel, go on over to DonutOperator.com, get some super sweet merch, and just follow me everywhere. Until next time, please have a fantastic day. Back.